Uh, where were you? What kind of player will you be in five years from now? Hey, I'll, I'll be, I'll be, I'll be much stronger. I'll be, I'll be much better in everything that I do. The court. Make them feel us, make them see us, have a presence up the court, talk, communicate. We got multiple things going, different looks to throw at the guys. Play fast, play random, play together, play in great space. Let's go play some basketball, have some fun. Turned over, picked up by Giannis. He blows it down the center of the floor. Only Chris Paul is back. He slams it. Pacumbo with the strong finish. Booker to Crowder. Crowder connects on a three. Crowder didn't hit a shot. Six on the 24. Booker fires a three. Got it. Showing the emotion, coaching his team. Forget history and forget everything else that happened in the past. I want you to tell me what your own eyes are seeing. And what my eyes are telling me is that the Phoenix Suns are the better team. The Phoenix Suns are the smarter team. The Phoenix Suns have the better coach. They have better leaders. They have better overall players. And with that being said, this series is over. Am I saying the Milwaukee Bucks are going to get swept? No, they probably win one or maybe two games before it's winning the series. Oh, the Suns are winning this series. I don't know if it's in five games. I don't know if it's in six games. I don't know if it's in seven games. But they're going to win this series just because of their IQ. I look at everything. I look at body language. I look at post-game interviews. You know what I'm hearing from Devin Booker? You know what I'm hearing from CP3 in a post-game interview? The job is not done. You look on the Milwaukee Bucks side of things, you know what I'm hearing? Oh, I'm just happy to be here. We haven't made it since 1933, and, and, and we're happy to be here, and we just want to have fun. And you see Chris Middleton and Drew Holiday smiling last night after they played the worst of, uh, you know, basketball of their playoff career last night on the biggest stage. And then you hear Mike Budenholzer, right? Uh, Pre-game, uh, pre-game, uh, uh, dressing pre-game in the, in the locker room. And he tells his team, go out, play freely, play in the open court. You know, just like I'm sitting up here looking at the TV saying, what? Are you serious right now? So with all that being said, this series is over. nobody calling you you don't care about a party the only thing you care about when you're trying to breathe is to get some fresh air that's it and when you get to the point where all you want to do is be successful as bad as you want to breathe then you'll be successful and I'm here to tell you number one that most of you say you want to be successful but you don't want it bad you just kind of want it you don't want it badder than you want to party. You don't want it as much as you want to be cool. You, most of you don't want success as much as you want to sleep. Some of you love sleep more than you love success. And I'm here to tell you today, if you're going to be successful, you've got to be willing to give up sleep. you got to be willing to work off for three hours of sleep, two hours. If you really want to be successful, someday you will have to stay up three days in a row. Go to sleep, you might miss the opportunity to be successful. That's how bad you gotta work. You gotta go days without, listen to me, you gotta wanna be successful so bad that you forget to eat. Stop Giannis tonight. Giannis is going to cook punishing the 
City. Bucks with a chance to win it all, but the Suns confident they can force a game seven. Brianna Zetetokounmpo simply the biggest game of his life. A chance to bring a title to a city that has become his home. For Chris Paul, also the most important game of his illustrious career. A chance to keep his dream of a title alive. Championship in 50 years. 
Middleton, pass inside Giannis. Turns and flushes! 45 for the great three! Giannis has been an MVP twice in this league, and he has said, I need to drive us home tonight. There's Bedlam in Foxland right now! Giannis Antetokounmpo with one of the most iconic performances in the storied history of the NBA Finals. Puts up the one-hander, shot is good! Does it again! 50 points. Only the seventh player in the history of the Finals to have a 50-point game. To the rebound. And that'll do it. It's over. The Bucks have done it. The long wait has ended after a half century. The Milwaukee Bucks are NBA champions once again. The emotions come pouring out. One of the greatest nights in Milwaukee sports history ends in a coronation. And ladies and gentlemen, the 2021 NBA champion, you're Milwaukee Bucks. let alone win a championship together in those eight years. How would you describe what Chris Middleton means to you? Chris, you did it, huh? You fucking did it. Young Dumb Yourself.